guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys had a wonderful day. I know I did, guys, but welcome back. If you don't know who I am, now you do, guys. My name is Justin. Smack that subscribe button below. Come part of our huge family as we grow every single day, whether it be numbers or knowledge, guys. Trying to hit that 300 subscriber mark, guys. We are, I believe, seven, seven away. Let's do it, guys. All right, so we got another brand new drink here, as you can see. We have Aviation Gin. You guys have seen me do the review on it before. Pretty Lady has picked out this drink for the most part. So she bought this drink yesterday. She wants to do it with some tequila. We ain't got none yet, so we got to go buy some. But she's like, hey, you should probably try it with the gin. So that's what we're doing here. We're going to take the gin. I don't spill it. And then, so this is... Um, Aviation Gin, really awesome gin. Uh, little thing about gin is this is actually, a, I think either sponsor or he co-owns it, um, Ryan Reynolds. This is his. Uh, so, yeah, pretty cool. All right, and this here is just your normal Minute Maid. It's watermelon punch. So, we're going to be pouring this right up in there. It's a lovely pink. There we go. It kind of reminds me of uh, the uh, New Amsterdam Pink Whitney. It's kind of what this looks like now. All right. Ooh. So you get that watermelon smell on the top, but it has that spiciness now from the aviation gin. It's got that real rich... Almost like a tequila smell, honestly, in my opinion. It might be the sugars they use, but this is distilled from grain, so it has that different smell. It has that graininess to it. Um, it is bottled in Portland, Oregon. It's 40%, no, 42% alcohol, making it 84 proof. But cheers, let's try it out. There's the color. It looks absolutely stunning. Beautiful pink. Ooh, that's so sweet. It's um, sweet and bitter at the same time. It's got a lot of that fruity watermelon candy taste to it. It doesn't have that, art uh, that real watermelon taste. It has that artificial candy Jolly Rancher taste. And then you add the aviation gin that gives it that little bit of a right in the mouth. Starts off so sweet, but the finish is really grainy. It's really kind of harsh. It doesn't burn any. It doesn't drag. It's pretty smooth, but it's not dry enough to where it's leaving your mouth dry. It still has a little bit of fragrance in there. Fragrance. A lot of flavor in there that kind of makes you want another one. And that has a lot to do with that watermelon punch. Minute Maid makes an awesome drink. Um... <clears throat> This is the one we used, watermelon punch. Uh, tastes great, wonderful combination. Not sure what else it would go good with. Maybe some vodka. We might have some toss that in some vodka or something. But I love how the watermelon kind of transitions all the way through the drink. It's not like it kind of stays in the beginning-ish and then goes away it goes all the way through the drink it doesn't dissipate really quickly and the aftertaste is more watermelon than it is gin so it's not like you get that harsh alcohol taste so if this is mixed right it's definitely going to be a wonderful springtime sip drink um, if you're outside putting some flyers out or whatever you got going mulching it's going to be something nice to sip on. Drop a few ice cubes in it. It's going to get you through your day. It tastes great. <sighs> Good drink, babe. Thanks, pretty laddie, for making this drink for me. Um, But guys, again, that was our review on Watermelon Punch and the Aviation's Ryan Reynolds Gin, guys. Um, hope you liked the review. Try it below, or try it below, try it, and tell me how you thought it tastes, or if you have tried it before, let me know. Or if you mix gin with anything else, let me know what you mix your gin with, because I'm dying to know. Guys, thank you for everything you do as you continuously watch, and as we grow together, whether it be in numbers or knowledge, every single day. Um, 
So we're about seven away from that 300 subscriber mark. I'm trying to, I want to hit it before next week. But hey, we got that's only today and tomorrow, so we we do what we can, guys. Thank you for everything you do. Thanks for still watching. If you're still here, hit that like button, smash the comments, and like I said, let me know if you drink your gin with anything else. Cheers. And may your day be as flavorful as mine is. Y'all have a wonderful day. And as always, guys, hit that notification bell. Let you know every single time that I go live and or when I post videos. We go live Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But we post videos Monday through Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday, guys. Till later, till next time. Till always, guys, you know who I am. I'm Justin. And I will see you tomorrow with another brand new video as always. Time to go finish my vacation up. I'll see you later.